Okay, okay. You won that one, Jesse. Let's maybe get inside the mansion before we pat ourselves on the back too much, shall we? That front door's definitely a no-go. Stick with me, guys! What? What'd you see? You just gasped. L like you'd seen something. Don't know who he was. Some creepy guy in the window. He had a white pumpkin for a head. White pumpkin? No such thing as white pumpkins. Let's save the agricultural discussions for inside, okay? <gasps> Great! There's no door back here. How are we supposed to get in? Go back that way! There! We should be able to build up and break in through there! Trees! We can cut those down! Good plan! And now my inventory is full of wood blocks. Hey, you never know when those will come in handy. Looks like there's some kind of kitchen in there. Then break the window and get us into the blasted place. Hope the host doesn't mind us breaking their window. I'm sure he'll find it in his heart to forgive us. Wow, some kitchen. Oh, dog. You know I don't care if you took it. Just give it back. And I'm telling you, for the last time, Sparkles, I didn't take the stupid thing. I think we could avoid a lot of unpleasantness. Uh. What the? Hi. Oh, ha, ha, ha. Very, very funny. Show up super late, make us all sit and wonder what the heck is going on. This is your house, right? Because if it is, we've all been waiting for, like, hours. It's rude. Now, easy, Torque Dog. Mm. Jesse, are you going to take this one, or shall I? This is Torque Dog. Sup. And I'm Captain Sparkles. Though, maybe you know that already. Captain Sparkles? I've got, like, nine million fans? Captain Sparkles? Are you saying that with a Z? Those are your names? Like your real names? Uh, yes. Huh. Weird. Anyway, I'm Jesse. That's Petra, Ivor, and Lucas. Charmed. Psst. Jesse. <laughs> That's a boy's name. What are you guys anyway? Some sort of <coughs> loser patrol? Twerk dog. Oh, come on. That was hilarious. Actually, we're the Order of the Stone. Legendary heroes. Kind of a big deal. Psh, legendary heroes? <laughs> I ain't never heard of you. Twerk dog. Cool it. That sea of zombies has us all trapped. So we just need to try our best to get along. Worst day ever. Hmm. All these other people as rude as you. Watch yourself, little dude. I tell you what, the minute all them weird zombies are gone, <gasps> Torque Dog is out of here. Okay, so the sea of zombies isn't normal. Good to hear. Two moons is normal, though, right? Um, the moons? Uh, yeah. Why don't you know about this stuff? Are you from, like, out of town or something? Ah! Oh, ow. Did you hear that? <laughs> Who touched my foot? Who touched my foot? I think it's. Hey, what's going on? <gasps> hey, Jesse. Jesse, come here. You've got a, a boy's name. Torque dog? Torque dog?
So I'm guessing calling dibs on his inventory would be... That poor guy. That's so awful. Yeah. He, uh, seemed like a little bit of a jerk. But that's still a nasty way to go. All those arrows, his inventory, everywhere. How did that... Who? One minute he's alive, the next... I know. That was absolutely awful. We were talking like a second ago, and then suddenly... He's full of arrows. Everyone stand back. Let me see what I can figure out. This is... why is this happening? Gunpowder, redstone dust, leather pants. Pretty much what you'd expect, I guess. Uh, who would do this? There's the trap door that sucked up Torque Dog's stuff. Looks like it's a matched set with that arrow dispenser up there. But you saw his stuff. He didn't really have anything worth stealing. Perhaps it was simply to dispose of the evidence. This whole thing is getting creepier by the minute. Guys, found something strange about this arrow. Ivor, you know potions and enchantments and weird stuff like that. What do you make of it? Mm. Smells like... Yes. Potion of poison? Oh, is it a t tipped arrow? Oh, I've heard of those. They're... they're still pretty new. Oh, nasty stuff. Using potions to make arrows. The possibilities are fascinating. You say you know about these tipped arrows. Anything else you know that you're not telling us? Well, you're, you're not implying what I think you're implying, are you? Because I had nothing to do with this. Nothing! Could have sworn I saw someone doing a tutorial on how to make those not too long ago. My nerves are too shot to remember who right now. Well, let me know if it comes back to you. Hello? Everything okay in here? Whoa! What's with the crowd? I, uh, I was just about to get everyone together to tell them at once. Okay? Hang on a minute. It's you! I recognize you. Excuse me? Uh, yes. What? Oh, really? Because I've never seen you in my life. I'll show you. Follow me. Um, okay. Lizzie, hi. Did you see all these new... Oh, you've got them with you. <gasps> well, first it was the portraits of the people already here, then poof. You guys... Whoa, that's unexpected. Yeah, no kidding. They're absolutely exquisite. Perfect. Well, not perfect. Absolutely perfect. Must have been when we showed up. This is so ridiculously creepy. Right? At first I was like, oh, cool, fan art, flattering. But the more I thought about it, Creepy is definitely right. Well, that's definitely not a good sign. Come on, everyone. Oh, let's huddle up in the dining room. Wonder if he told them yet. Can't wait to hear the big news. Me neither. Ooh, I hope there's cake. Guess not. Come on, let's do this. Come on, Winslow. Here, let me introduce you all properly. You guys already met Cassie Rose and LD Shadow Lady. Uh, but my friends call me Lizzie. This is Stacy Plays, Stampy Cat, and that's Dan, the Diamond Minecart. W when did your hair change color? Wasn't it? It's funny. Before you guys showed up, we all knew each other here. They're the Order of the Stone. Jesse, Petra, Lucas, and Ivor. Apparently, they're famous heroes where they come from. You said there was news? Is it good? Good news? Uh, 
Yeah, it's, um, bad news, I'm afraid. Torque Dog is dead. Good heavens! Oh, no! Wait, what? But Torque Dog was so tough! There was nothing that could take him down. What happened? Yeah, what on earth is going on here, Sparkles? I was there. It was a terrible accident. An accident? Oh my! Oh, come on, Stampy. Don't be so gullible. Must have been quite the accident to take out Talk Dog. I can't believe Talk Dog's gone. Just like that. So, what happened to his stuff? Whoa! How can you say that? What? It's a valid question. Whoa. His stuff just disappeared. Went down this weird hole in the floor. Are we just supposed to take your word for that? Guys, I saw it too. Jesse was poking around in Torque Dog's stuff right before it got sucked into a hopper. So I'm looking at this situation, I'm trying to figure something out. Is this just about Torque Dog, or is there a bigger picture? Yeah, why have our portraits? I don't know, guys. Knowing Torque Dog, I think this might just be about him. Am I picking up some beef here? Okay, but then why invite us all here? That's true. Hadn't thought about that. Well, someone brought us here for a reason, including Talk Dog. What if we're all in danger? Oh my gosh! Dan's right! Whoever's doing this, they could be hunting us! Hey, I don't know what kind of danger you guys are wrapped up in, but we just met you, so... I'm thinking this isn't my problem. Well, uh, we're all stuck in this house now, so it kind of is your problem too. Oh, all of this danger talk has my stomach all queasy. Stampy, come over here. I need to talk to you about something. Lizzie, psst. Lizzie. The more I think about it, the more I think that there's something these people really don't want us to know. One of them's got to know the truth about what's going on here. Sounds like we've got a mystery to solve, people. Luckily, Detective Jesse is on the case.